In this video, we're going to learn how to calculate the area of a triangle in C using user input values for the triangle's base and height. The first thing we'll do is declare variables to store the triangle's base, height, and area. So we'll have double, base, height, and area. So here we've declared three double variables. We've used the type double for these variables because a double variable can store a number with a decimal place, like 2.5. The next thing we'll do is prompt the user to enter in the triangle base. So we'll have printf and then base colon in quotes here. So here we're calling the printf function and we're passing it a string with the text base colon and space. That text is going to be output to the terminal to prompt the user to enter in the triangle base. Next, we'll use scanf to store the value that the user enters into the base variable. So we'll have scanf and then percent %lf and then and base. So here we're calling scanf with two arguments. The first argument is a string with percent %lf inside of it. Percent %lf is when you have the scanf function accept a double value from user input. The second argument here and base is going to have scanf store the double value into the base variable. The AND character is actually an operator that's going to return the memory address of the base variable. SCANF is going to store the value into that memory address that is provided as an argument. We'll prompt the user for the height of the triangle and store it into the height variable in the same way. So we'll have printf and then height colon and then we'll have SCANF and percent %lf and this time we'll have AND height to store the value that's entered into the height variable. Next, we can actually calculate the area of the triangle. So the area of a triangle is one half the base times the height. So we'll have area is equal to 0.5 times the base times the height. So when we use the star character like this, it's going to perform the mathematical operation multiplication. We're gonna multiply 0.5 for one half by the base and by the height. We're going to store the result into the area variable using the assignment operator, which is equals. Finally, we can output the area. So we'll have printf area colon percent f backslash n and then area. So here we're going to open the text area colon and then space. Percent f is telling printf to expect a double value to be provided and to output it here. Here, we're supplying area as that double value. Backslash n is the special new line character. We're going to end our output with the new line character, so that way if printf is called again, the text will appear on the next line in the terminal. And we could save, compile, and run our program, and then enter in a base of 10.5 and a height of 8.2, and we get 43.05, which is correct. Now notice that we get many decimal digits of precision in our output here. We could modify this. Here, we could add in a precision field. We could say dot two. This will output the double value with two decimal digits of precision. So we could save, compile, and run our program. And then we could enter in 10.2, and let's say 8.3, and we get 42.33 here. We only have two decimal digits of precision. So that's one thing we can do to make our output a bit more readable. And this is how we can calculate the area of a triangle in C using user input values for the triangle base and height. Check out PortfolioCourses.com where we'll help you build a portfolio that will impress employers, including courses to help you develop C programming projects.